Well, welcome to Mama Sue's kitchen. As you can see, it's not my kitchen at home. Harold and I are camping and we, uh, I wanted to have something that I can show you that's easy to do. And this is, I, it's at night that I'm putting this on right now and I'm gonna cook it all night. And then tomorrow, it'll be ready. I'll just, then I'll turn my crock pot on warm and we'll have it, it's called a Mississippi roast and it is made in the crock pot. Now, I brought a roast that I had um, when, when we bought the uh, beef from a local farmer and it is frozen, frozen solid. So if you have this at home and you want to do it you can either use a fresh roast or a frozen one then all you're going to do is you're going to take one package of hidden valley ranch uh, mix and you're going to just sprinkle it on top of the roast you're going to take a package of au jus gravy, the dry mix, and sprinkle it also. Okay. One stick of butter. I make this a lot at home. Probably once a month or every six weeks because it's delicious and then it makes good sandwiches later. The very last thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take the peppers and I brought these from home. There's four in there and I'm just gonna pour those and the juice in with it. You don't put any water because it's going to make its own juice. And y'all, tomorrow when I come back, I did put a liner in my crock pot. Saves on cleanup. I'm gonna cook this all night. And it does, there's no certain hours. I just put it on when I'm about to go to bed. And in the morning when I get up, I take two forks and if it has cooked long enough, it just tears all to pieces. You could do this also if you wanted to do it one morning. If, you, if you're going to work and you wanted to put it on and have it ready when you get home, it would be ready. But I'm going to plug this in and then I'm going to make sure that it is on low. And it is. And in the morning, we'll be back and we'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Welcome back to Mama Sue's Kitchen Winter Camper. Last night before I went to bed, I showed you how I put a roast in the crock pot and my roast was completely frozen. And this morning when I got up, I could already smell the yumminess of it. And it, it, was, it is so, so tender. I just take two forks and I pull it all apart. Now, you can eat this as a meal with potatoes and peas or whatever. But since we're camping, we're gonna have roast beef sandwiches and it's absolutely delicious. And you saw there was nothing to do this. You can put it on at night when you start to bed and it will be ready in the morning. There's no amount of hours. So don't say, do I cook it five hours, eight hours, or whatever. It makes its own juice. And so, I'm going to show you how this roast, it's so, so tender. 
just pull it apart with a fork. And the au jus gravy mix and the Hidden Valley Ranch just makes it absolutely delicious. So I just wanted to share that with you. We're camping and just having the best time, but I wanted you to know that even when you're camping, you don't have to eat um, cold sandwiches all the time. Use your crock pot because you can do the same thing while you're camping that you can do at home. But y'all, God is so, so good. Our baby, we, we found out that um, he does have a little pneumonia, but he didn't have to be hospitalized. He is on the antibiotics at home, and so far he's doing great. His stats are staying good. So thank you for all your prayers for him. We, um, we love you, and we know that you're like family. I do want to tell you, Harold and I were um, at Walmart in Foley, Alabama the other day, and the sweetest lady stopped me and said, don't I know you? And I thought, well, I don't know. And she said, I do, your mama Sue. And it just made my day to see someone who is following me from South Alabama and stopped to say hello. Y'all, God is good. Be salt and light wherever you go. Let others see Jesus in you. And I'll be back soon.